Hey everybody, welcome to some more X4. In this video, we're going to take a look at data vaults and what they do, how to use them, things like that. So first, you can find them out in the world. So this one I found in Prop Center Alpha. It's just this little bookmark and it has data vault on it. You cannot right click and, and go to it. So you kind of have to navigate your own way to it. But this is kind of what it looks like. It's this big satellite space station looking thing. You will need your spacesuit and a repair laser. So make sure that you have that. There are these little terminals that you see here that you go and unlock. So let's go for a spacewalk. Hello there. Hello. Use spacesuit. So we will go unlock these. If you have explored a wreckage, it's a little bit similar in that it's a pressure leak that you need to repair. Slow down, slow down. Here we go. So let's stop. There we go. Let's make sure we don't use any of our bombs or lasers. You just use the repair laser and shoot at it. All right, status is okay. And that opened up the uh, hatch up here. And there's another one right here. So let's go deal with this. Whoa, another hatch. All right, I don't see any uh, anything in there though, so they're not always guaranteed to have uh, stuff in them. So this open actually a bunch actually opened. So you're looking for oh I thought I saw it. You're looking for data leak indicators. Right. There were some more hatches under here. Uh, some more controls, I should say. I am awful at controlling the spacesuit, so excuse me. Okay, these are unlocked. Take a look. Uh, nothing in there. There's my raider. Very cool. Oh, I forgot to be, I uh, wasn't in scan mode. Now, there was, I thought, one more. Oh, there's another uh, panel over there. I don't see any over here. So let's go unlock that panel. Just again, using the repair laser. That's cool. The. Uh, solar panels shifted. All right. So let's go up here. Oh, you can see my shadow. That's awesome. We will check out this compartment.
Oh, hello. So there's something definitely in here. If I could steer this thing. I know everyone's going to tell me, oh, just use backspace. I do use backspace. The momentum doesn't quite work right for me. So there's another thing to unlock here. And that unlocks this one. So let's go check out this one. Hello, is that a door? Container. Oh, we got a security slicer, digital seminars, and a security bypass system. So someday that digital seminar will be cool. Uh, do I have a tractor beam on a spacesuit? Yes, but it doesn't work on that. All right, so let's go get this. Got it. Let me just bounce around. I don't think I can do anything with this door. I hear a data leak. I think it's next door. I was hoping to get some blueprints, honestly. All right, so we got a data leak. Let's check that out. Okay, data decrypted, new entry added to the timeline. The timeline is kind of where they give a historical view of uh, the game and their lore. You can access that in the encyclopedia. And then right here on the left timeline, and we got entry seven, a uh, date seven sixty four. Relations with, it, relations with the Terrans begin to cool. And it gives you a nice little cutscene and explanation. Dealing with the major COG offenses at the end of the COG conflict, the community of planets was eager for Sol to join its ranks. The government of Earth and the outer just Sol system, this. Geos, the system wide government of Sol, was willing to undertake a loose alliance with their long lost cousins. The Ark Confederation alone, but declined the offer to join the community. Other races were hurt by what they saw as a slight against them, and relations slowly began to cool off. But the Jump Gate Network once again knew peace for a short while. Awaiting orders. Okay. So we got that. I don't hear anything else. Let's take a quick look. I, there may be more stuff to open still, so let's. Because, like, we haven't opened this yet. So we have to uh, look around a little. I hate being in the spacesuit, so I'm going to go back to my ship. Teleport. The greatest thing ever. <laughs> All right, let's uh, make see if we missed anything. All right, we got that one. We got that one. Looking for red uh, control panels. All right, that looks good. We uh. Trying to get underneath there. Of course, I'm in a big ship. I should really have used a small ship for this. Come on. Let me look. Let me look under there. All right. Don't see any red. All right, don't, that looks good. I don't see any more panels to unlock unless they are located elsewhere, which I don't think they are. I think they're all in the, uh, the, the superstructure here. All right, so I guess we uh, exhausted this data relay. So that's how you deal with data relays.
I was uh, really hoping to get blueprints, but did not. It says data, but we did get data. We got the timeline. We got a bunch of uh, security equipment worth about four, 500K. So, you know, definitely could be worth your time to check these out, especially if you want the story. All right, that'll do it for this video. Thanks for watching.